In the last episode, we did some preparation for the baby's room. And I have to say a big thank you to all you guys that were being really nice in the comments because I told you guys I was a bit sick last week. But thank you so much for saying get well soon and being patient with me for that episode. But we did the baby's room and the baby's room is all ready for the baby to arrive in our house. So it's looking pretty good so guys today what i want to do is as you guys know the baby's due soon now look at bella like look bella is getting i don't even know how she got so big so quick so i have no clue how long it's going to take for the baby to come uh, might as well tell her to clear up the sport food we have no long uh how how i don't know how long it takes for babies to get delivered on the sims so it might be here today who knows but what i want to do is i want to go grab another prisoner for my prison because we built this we need to consistently have a flow of prisoners down here so what i want to do is i want to take a visit to the to the club it's 4 a.m in the morning let's do it let's go to the club and let's do it what's wrong with him stuffed up oh he's sick yeah go to the club spread your sickness it don't matter let's just go do this so we're going to travel and we are going to wait travel there we go travel and we're not going to travel with anyone we're just going to go to the club and see if we can meet somebody to bring them back to our little dungeon we need to consistently have people in our dungeon guys we can't like we can't slack on the evilness that is the whole point of this series you know we have to be evil we have to continue doing these things now i'm going to go over to this area to see if i can meet anybody here we don't want to go to the gym for we're going to go to the nightclub that's where we're going to go it's 4 a.m in the morning what other place will be open but a nightclub so we're going to go check it out see if there's anyone there see if there's anyone new there because i guarantee you there's going to be a bunch of zombies coming back i guarantee you that but let's see if there's anyone at this nightclub there is absolutely no one at this nightclub oh wait wait, wait, wait. before you go in there you need to get changed you need to change your appearance where is that change outfit we need to get ready into our nighttime outfit there we go and you can go in there get changed real quick is there anyone here oh who's that who are you i've never met you before leon we have a new person guys oh my god it is amazing we have a new person anyone up here no this is the deadest nightclub i've ever seen <laughs> there is absolutely no one here absolutely no one so i guess what we're gonna have to do is go and introduce ourselves to leon let's go do it let's go do it grab chips can't we just talk to him enchanting introduction you guys know that's the one that always works let's do it so hello leon how do you like dungeons leon hey do you like dungeons you can put them petals in your drink if you want make it real good is anyone actually going to show up i guess me and you leon i'm to have, i'm gonna just keep talking to leon see if we can get him to come back let's do bright and day let's do compliment outfit look at him just flipping those drinks hey D uh, leon can we just be friends please can we be friends and you you're the only person here i wasn't i wasn't trying to like make you go to my house but i've got no other choice leon you know i've got no other choice ask for a small loan oh bella has work we're at the club and bella has work our pregnant wife yes yeah, she's our wife now isn't it? we got married our pregnant wife is at the club is about to go to work and we're just sitting here like oh do we know each other now yeah that's good um yeah our pregnant wife is just going to work and we're just sitting here at the club just having a good time right i think that's good yeah no one showed up to the club so right leon you are gonna be our next victim so let's um travel and can we travel with leon is he there is he on our list there he is leon you're coming back with me leon you're coming back to the house i'm gonna get you off work don't worry about your work just come back with me to my house we're traveling together how do i change my name guys can you tell me how to do that spencer kim lewis and friends i'm not spencer kim lewis whoa i didn't even know you could get all these things look cats and dogs i might get cats and dogs guys if you want me to get cats and dogs so i can have a new kind of like pet have an evil dog make him attack people <laughs> that'd be amazing but if you want me to get cats and dogs or any of these expansion packs guys let me know how much are they does it say look at me just checking i'm just checking the price right now guys oh i didn't mean to do that no something popped off in my screen let's close that there we go <laughs> right let's go back home with leon sorry about that got a little bit distracted let's go back home with leon and uh we're gonna 
introduce him to my cellar downstairs, my dungeon where I keep all of the people and Leon you are going to be right at home inside of my dungeon I promise you it's going to be real cosy, do you want me to put a little bar in there for you Leon? I'm going to put it, whoa! Leon looking like a cool dude! Look at you. Leon how did you get that hat? Whoa! Leon's looking all fashionable and everything. I'd never seen anyone wear the... Because that hat, guys, that hat, I downloaded it as extra content. But Leon managed to wear it. I think Leon's a hacker. I think you deserve to get locked up, Leon. So let's start chatting first, right? Let's just ask about your day real quick. And then we're going to jump downstairs. And then we are going to go and chat here. But before we do that, I need to unlock... All the doors on. Oh no, can we allow access to. No, no, no. Let's unlock and we are going to unlock. So, yeah, Leon, come downstairs to your dungeon with your cool little outfit on. Let's do this. Whoa, what's that noise? He's angry. Why is he angry? Why is he so angry? Oh, he's, he's getting angry, but he's getting a prisoner. Right, we're good. We're good. We're in there. Nice and easy. Right, we're going to lock for everyone but ricky there we go and we're gonna lock this for everyone but ricky and then we are going to go and chat here this why was it so easy why is he walking like that i have no idea why he's walking like that why was it so easy to get this prisoner guys there we go look put, look how easy that was that was so easy you saw how difficult it was for me to get the other ones and look leon <laughs> that was so easy so easy i can't believe that there we go, Leon. How you doing? Wait, why did you just walk through the wall, man? Why are you walking through walls? You're making my life so much harder. Maybe it was me who made my life harder, you know, not Leon. And now watch Leon walk out. Come on, stop talking. Stop talking. Stop talking. You need to walk out of the room. Leon needs to stay there. Leon, stay where you are. Thank you very much. And we're going to put that back. So it, it wasn't any of the criminals. Well, not the criminals, prisoners. It's not any of the prisoners that ruined my life before. It was my own character because he likes to walk through walls. But there we go, Leon. Make yourself at home. I gave you the biggest cell, okay, Leon? I gave you the biggest cell. And look, look at you looking all fashionable. I think he's too good to be a prisoner. Look at him. But he's our first male prisoner. I told you guys I didn't want to discriminate, you know? But we're going to go and cook Leon some food. Because we like to treat our prisoners well, guys. I told you this before. We like to treat, treat him well. And we're going to go cook him some food. What do you want, Leon? You want something nice? You want something nice? What's this? Oh, we've got to make you a cake. You know what? We're going to cook you a roast chicken. That's what we're going to do, Leon. Whoa, wh where did I go? Threat report. What is this? What is this? Oh, Bella. Uh, ask for help, Bella. I don't know what he did, but ask for help. Did he make his roast chicken? Whoa, he's taking a long time. That roast chicken. Why did he? Wait. Wait, did he just put the roast chicken in the fridge? I, don't... I think he just put it in the fridge. Why would he do that? What? What happened to our roast chicken? Can I? Oh, there it is. Thank you. I was like, where is my roast chicken? Uh, it's like, uh, why did he do that? There you go, Leon. You've got a nice little roast chicken there for you. You've got a toilet. D d right, guys. I'm telling you, right? You know, before when we had our prisoners in these two little cells, they should not have died. So I don't know why they died, but I fed them. So Leon's got everything he needs. He's got a toilet. He's got um, a bed. He's got food. He's got everything he needs. You know what? Let's even treat him even a little bit better. Let's give him a little bit of a table so we can sit down and actually eat his food. Wait, wait, what did I type in there? I did not type that in. I typed table. <laughs> That's what I typed in. Why is it? Why does it keep giving me that? Table. There we go, table. My Google Home just went off, guys. Did you hear that? My Google Home in the background was like, I don't understand. I don't know what, I don't know what's going on, guys. What's going on? Look, let's give him a little table. Let's give him a little table there. Let's move him, move this over. You know what? Let's put that there. And there we go. What? Can't that, can't that go in there? Yeah, look, see? Perfect. And then put you guys there. So you've got a little table where you can actually eat your food now, Leon. Perfect. So there should be no excuses for you to not.
die? <laughs> I don't know. Just don't die, Leon, all right? You're a cool little dude that I met you. Look, I like the fact you're wearing one of my hats. It looks really cool. Oh, it looks sad now. He was he was real happy before, but he's now he's sad. So what am I doing right now? I'm just sitting there. Right, you need to go work out because last time I saw you, you were getting a bit chub chub. What is he doing there? He is going to the refuge. Is that is that a playing a game? I think that might be playing. A game. Oh no, he looks like he's lost weight. He looks like he's actually lost weight. So guys, pretty much now, whoa, 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 he needs to fix this. So pretty much now, guys, all we're pretty much doing is waiting for the baby. That is the next big thing. I don't know when it's going to happen. I'm hoping it's going to happen soon, but I don't know when it's going to happen. But Bella, she was meant to take leave off work. I got a notification that she could take leave off work, right? I'm pretty sure. Where is it? There we go. Look, Bella can now take family leave. So she can take leave off work. That means the baby must be due pretty soon. Are you okay, Bella? Where did you go? What was going so fast? Is Bella okay? She's having a bath. All right, I'll let you relax in the bath, Bella. All right, you chill. You chill yourself. Oh, whoa, she put her hair up. That's some attention to detail right there. I didn't even know they'd do that. But are you relax in the bath, Bella. You are giving birth to my first child. Oh, I'm tired. I'm tired. No excuse. Seems bladder... Did he pee himself? Oh. Wait, what? Sims bladder is full. Oh, la, 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 la. Did, he, did he just pee himself? Who's that outside? Is that another zombie? Who is that? He's got a lab coat on. Who's this? Are we finally getting new people in the game? Oh, no, it's Jeffrey. We already killed him. Why is Jeffrey still alive? Elmer. Oh, he's a new person. I've never met him before. So let's go back to me. Let's see what I'm up to. Um, he's going upstairs. Is he going to go talk to... Oh, no, he's going to sleep. He is going to sleep. Fair enough. So, guys, we got our new prisoner. And he... Oh, look, he's eating the chicken. Yes, he's going to stay alive. There we go. We've actually got a prisoner who's actually going to eat stuff and stay alive. That is awesome. So, he definitely shouldn't die now. So, because he's eating his food, he's having a good time. You know what? I think we're going to take good care of this prisoner. I want you to live a long time, Leon. That is my target. We might get some other prisoners to see what happens to him, but Leon, you know what? Because you had one of my hats on, I like you, and I think I want you to live for a long time. So if you want anything else, you know what? I might give you a TV or something. You could chill. Just live your life in here. Look, I've got some chicken for you. You're just eating it all up. It's all good. But guys, yes, like I said, the biggest thing we're waiting for now is the baby. So that is what's going to happen next. But guys, I think I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it.